All right, guys, here we go. Close your eyes, focus on your breathing. Make yourself as calm as you possibly can to where you almost feel like you have no more thoughts. You guys check them out. Go left. Go left. Go left. Oh, oh. You were nowhere near that. Mill Resort. All right, Ghost Gang, it has probably been one of the worst days for us. The first location that we were supposed to drive all the way to California had canceled on us last minute, and now we got offered a penthouse at one of the casinos. It's been like six, seven hours now before we could actually get this room. So finally got the keys, and now to do our investigation, go check it out. Thank you so much for gifting us this penthouse, and yeah, let's go! Oh, dude! Whoa! Oh my God! Wow! Dude, this is crazy. Yo, guys, you want some? You want some shots, bro? Dude, you want some shots? Oh my God! There's another room. That's Holy crazy. shit! Oh my God! Look how huge that is! Look how big that jet is, dude! Oh my God! The shower has literally a clean, clean your the whole ass right now. The shower has a marble <laughs> bench, though. We can all shower together. Exactly. Wyatt. Come here! We can all shower together right now, dude. We literally could. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, sick. Hey, have you seen the guys? There's only one place. Boys, only one place. <laughs> oh, get me out of here, Dusty Bro. <laughs> I wonder where the other guy is. <laughs> Did I hit you? Shut up. What the f***? Where is he? Where did he go? No shit, Nick. You're really not right there? Oh god, dude! Oh my god, oh my god bro. Oh, no. What's up? I'm surprised no. no one sat on me first. I was no. there for a while. Way. The shit you don't see? When you're like focusing on a little square, you literally will pass by stuff. Like oh that. no, I I uh, just figured that out. All right, sit up. It's nice down there though. In 1971, two lifelong friends, Nat Caraselli and Bill Paganetti, had opened the Peppermill Coffee Shop and Lounge in Reno, Nevada. Nat and Bill wouldn't just settle there, so they decided to continue on their company and grow their business even bigger. In 1979, they had partnershiped with the Sino family and expanded into gaming. This was a major turning point into their company. The Peppermill had expanded and opened three more resort casinos in their name. This has grown them to be a staple in Nevada and one of the most successful businesses to ever land here. As of 1980, the Peppermill Resort Casino only had 57 rooms. Today, the Peppermill has grown to have over 1,600 rooms, 780 suites, and over 17 floors. Jumping into the haunted portion of the Peppermill, it is said that floors 11 through 17 are all haunted. Why this is, nobody really knows. But what we do know is that floor 16 is one of the most haunted floors out of any of them. People have reported knocks scratching on the wall, footsteps, and even 
voices in their own room when they know that nobody else is there. Mm. One of the spirits that somebody says that lives there is known to be a trickster spirit and likes to joke around. Our goal tonight is to try and find out if the stories and rumors are true and to find out who or what is really there. So let's go. Okay, Ghost Gang, so we were lucky enough to be given this beautiful suite. We are here at the Pepper Mill, the Tuscany Tower, in the Penthouse Suite. Now, we are on the 16th floor. Nick knows a lot more about this than I do, though. Floors 11 through 17 are supposedly very haunted here in the Pepper Mill, but floor 16 is renowned to be one of the worst and most active. Did you not just hear that knock right there? Has that been going off quiet? Mm -hmm. No way. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Were you filming that? Yeah. Continue. Okay. Okay. Floor 16 is known to be the most haunted out of all of those. There are stories of voices where there shouldn't be, loud knocks, footsteps, and there's even a story of a spirit who thinks himself to be a comedian who might call out to you using your name in almost a mocking voice. Well, you good? You've already seen us, and I just wanted to let you know that we were given this opportunity to come and stay in this beautiful suite. I see that you've noticed us and discovered some of the objects that we have. I just want to let you know that we will be here for the rest of the night until morning. I'd like to introduce all four of us. My name is Ryan. The guy to the right of me, his name is Nick. The guy to the left of me, his name is Wyatt. And the guy right in front of me, holding the big bright light, if you see it, his name is River. Now we heard quite a few stories, and somebody had told us that there has been a couple of people staying on this floor. That yours and mine just went off. Thank you so much. And you're facing that way. Some of the people said that they've heard you. If you could please give us a sign that you are here. We have objects. As you can see, these light up colors. If you come around, hold on to one of our arms. Thank you. We also have another object. We call them devices. I don't know what you know them as. This object you can walk up to and you can talk to it. You can use your words and speak to us. If you could please let us know where you are. One. One really large one. Thank you so much. This object here, I'll show you how to use it in just a second. I'm bringing it over here into this room. I'm going to set it right here on this bed. What you do is you walk up to this object and this metal bar right here, if you get close to it, you can hold on to it. You can just get close if you'd like to and that'll show us that you're here as well. So if you could please show us that you're here, we'd like to know. Uh, okay. As soon as I'm walking out. As soon as we're walking. Thank you. That just gave me chills, bro. That's crazy. Not gonna lie, we were a little bit iffy when somebody told us about this place and had given us this room as a gift. But so far... Whoa. Did you hear something in there? I heard some... I don't know where that was. What I did you hear? Knock. knock? Yeah. Knock? Did it really just say knock? knock? That's what you heard? No, I heard a hiss or a whistle. Okay, listen to me. You heard something in there, and yeah. as soon as you said, Whoa. I heard a knock right over here. Right in this general area. I looked wait, at why. Wait, 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 wait. I don't think you heard it, did you? You did hear it? It's that room. Sick. Oh God. 
This is intense. Dude, this is <laughs> creepy, bro. I'm so creeped out. Can you please give us your name? We would appreciate it so much if you gave us your name and we can hang. Scary. Scary? Did I not just say that's so creepy? Yeah, you did. I literally just got done saying it's creepy. As I was saying, we'd, we'd love to know who you are because we'll hang out with you all night. Okay, this object here, this is another one. So this will track your movement. It can also be used to answer anything you'd like to answer as a yes or a no. Red is no, and then this side is green. This is a yes. If you're walking behind here, because this is where Wyatt keeps... Wealthy. This is where Wyatt keeps hearing Wealthy? you. Wealthy? I mean, that's a little bit relevant for where we are. Where we are. Oh, yeah. They could have been wealthy at one point, or were. Anyways, I just want to tell you, all you have to do is you walk by. It should be able to track you just like that if you'd like to show us that you are here. I'm going to move it a little bit. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. What was that? What was that? What are you talking about? It was like, yeah, it was like a... I thought I Guys, heard I'm getting early. chills so bad. Look at this, dude. Is that you? Did we just hear you? Damn. And we're gonna stay here tonight? Yeah, Hold on. Did you not just hear the frickin' right chair? Someone just sat in it. What's that hissing noise? I don't know. Can you hear me? This feels like toast. I see a shadow. I wouldn't even call it a hiss. Do you guys see that? Can you hear me? This see the shadow on the bed? I don't know if that's one of them, it but. Hiss, though. It, it was just like a. Like a whistle. Oh! Arthur. <gasps> Arthur, are Arthur, you in there? I just asked. Oh, that sounds like a wealthy name, guys. Uh, are you in there, Arthur? Can you give us another sign that you're here? Maybe grab that device again? So cool. I heard I heard a knock. I did hear a knock. I hear that. I really hope our mics are picking that up. So two of us took our shoes off because we don't want to make any noise. I mean should the guys we take our shoes off. You guys should. I'm telling you guys should. I mean I honestly think it might be a good idea for future locations to like, ooh, ooh, Ina, Ina. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Watch out. <gasps> Watch out. <laughs> what? <laughs> We're just beating up our shoes. That EMF just spiked really high, too. Did it really? Yeah, it did. Like that. <laughs> but it did it like twice. <laughs> it just did it twice again. Mine's not doing anything. Can you please walk up to mine? Hold on to my arm? Show us that you are here by any chance. If you can hear me. And if you. Sandra. 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 If you feel comfortable enough to show me that you can hear me, I walked. That was in your hand. Thank you so much. We're enjoying this. We're, oh, we're enjoying this? I've never heard that before. We're plural. Arthur and Sandra, oh, Arthur, we did get guys. a woman's name. It totally slipped. I wonder if that's like a married couple or just it could be two separate people that died at different times. But what if it was a couple that like were in that suite and happened to die together? That would be crazy. To my mind, I'm sorry that I didn't or we didn't say anything to you. Hello. It's nice to meet both of you. We were only told that there might be one person here we didn't know that there were two and thank you so much for showing both of you to us so far this is why i feel like they get a lot of uh, evidence and interaction is because of how nice they are to everyone that could explain or the, the spirit steps that you said you heard. consider it that's a good point sandra are you in heels by any chance are you wearing heels I just Ooh, got the chills, there. like... Loud step. Is there somebody in here? 
I'm gonna set this right here. If you'd like to pass by here, or give us another sign that you are here and you can maybe sit on the bed and come have a talk with us. Sound. Hear that whistle? Yeah, I just heard a I, I heard that too. Where are you? Oh! Did it? That's the pyramid's going off. That must have been me. What is that? Shit is picking up now. Was that the phone? That sounded like the phone. We don't have a phone. No. Do we? There's like a landmine somewhere in here. I saw it's it. It's in the bathroom. But there there's one a... right there too. Is that there is a phone right there? there? I don't think it. I didn't... Why is there a phone in the bathroom? Is that like a thing back then? I can hear it from there. Control. Control. I think it was in the bathroom. It's the one in the bathroom. Dude. Holy shit. Did they just try to call us over the phone? They said control. Hang on. What the heck? What was that sound? Because if somebody from the front desk was trying to call us, that would continuously ring, wouldn't it? Oh, yeah. Dude. That was just a one. It was a one ring, dude. And then <laughs> turned off. But that, I'm sorry. It didn't sound like it was in there. It sounded like it was a... What did it just say? Can you please Don't confirm? tell people. And then the devices. Don't tell people that you guys are here. <gasps> or don't tell people that you know how to manipulate things. Because you're doing a great job. Can you do the phone again? Oh, please do the phone again. That tripped me out. Front desk wouldn't just ring you once, I don't think. Nor did they ever call you. Especially at this time, it's 12, 11 yeah. in the morning. Yeah. There's no way they'd bother you like that. What? The I didn't hear that. I've been hearing it. Is it time to go to the bathroom? Yeah, go on, go in there. You guys going in the bathroom? Well, there's a lot of noises happening. I don't want to all like cluster oh, yeah. in here. Okay, I guess we're splitting up in this suite. <laughs> if you're in here with us, excuse can you me, guys. I don't mean to keep coughing. That's in my hand. Oh, oh, that just went off. Did you get that? I didn't. I don't have a wide enough angle. Okay, Sandra. There you go. Or Arthur. Who is it? Which one of you is it? Sandra. Can you please give us a sign if it's Sandra? Or Sandra? I don't know exactly how you pronounce it. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. Or if it's Arthur. Oh, okay. That's his light. I was looking at the... I don't know if those are windows or what, what they are. On the right-hand side, I was looking at them, and uh, it, I, thought it was, I thought I saw some, but it was just the lights of their cameras. Get out. Get out. It's the first time it said that. Are we upsetting you by being in here? They were nice at first. If you want us out, we can leave. Oh! I didn't step in front of that, Rip. I swear. Okay, I mean, well, we have that camera. Okay, look, this is where I was. Say yes, we'll go. If it would have tracked me, you'd hear. You'd start okay, hearing. Okay, walk up to it and see how close. Yeah, you were not that close. Well, we could check on that camera. Okay, cool. Let's check. Let's Got check. Close. He was Where that close. I didn't. Oh, he, he I wasn't that close. That, I swear. Okay. I well, mean, we have that camera. Okay. Look, this is where I was. Say yes, we'll go. If it would have tracked me, you'd hear. You'd start okay, hearing. Okay. Walk up to it and see how close. Yeah, you were not that close. Well, we could check on that camera. Okay. Cool. I, I can wait till it resets and then I'll, I'll stand here again as, just to make sure. Kinda gotta pee real bad. You can go pee? You want me to hold the camera? Yeah, I gotta pee. Okay, I'm gonna try it again.
Oh, oh, oh! Riv! What? It's going off! You gotta pee, bro! River had to pee. Can you make that go? Thank you! I was just gonna ask if you could make it go off again. It's, it's continuously going off, Riv. Thank you so much. Riv! Riv Hod! Riv Hod! Riv Hod! Riv Hod! Riv Hod! I didn't even flush the toilet. It's not going off. No, it was just going off. I, I got it. I already got it. Thank you so much. Is this Arthur or Sa Sandra or Sandra? Is there anything we can help you with? Why are you hurting? Guys? I heard it that time. Was that I the phone that again? Time. Guys? Guys? Uh, Wait, was that the phone again? We didn't hear it. Oh my f god. We just heard it again. Out there? Right? It sounded like it was in here. What the f***, dude? I'm so confused. Uh, that yeah. didn't happen when we were in there. That was a pretty loud knock or something. Why were you so quiet when we were in there? Okay. There's that object over there. If you are in there and you don't want us in there, that is totally fine. We'll give you your privacy. If you do want to show us that you are in here, in this bathroom, you could just go ahead and let us know. Hold on. They're probably like, dude, I'm trying to take a shit right now. Can you get the fuck out of my bathroom? Onto that object right there. Uh -huh. and we'll know it's you. We're trying to talk with you. See if you can show us some cool stuff. Don't be fearful. Ian, yeah, then that room's going on. Fearful? Off. No way. Yeah, it was. I could see it from a distance. Like that. Holy! That's full! I have to find something to focus on first. What's wrong? Oh, it's going to just completely out of focus. I just zoomed in from like a mile away, though. Can you make that device? I was literally just about to say, can you please make that device? Green. They went green. Yeah. They're all going I, off. I took the REM pod away from there. I Dude. took it away from there. All three of these are going off at the same time. Communicate. Thank you so much. That's how they're communicating. That's what we're here to do. We just really want to talk to you. If you need any help, we'd love to try to help you. Uh, right on that round table, right there. I can do it. Okay. Thank you. No. Shit. That's not an issue with the device? I don't think so. Ah, uh, dick, I wasn't filming. Electric. Electric? Electric. Electric. I did tell them that they can use our, Wait. our devices. Wait, what was that, that noise? I'm standing beside you. Standing beside you. Yeah, standing beside you. I, I don't know how. Who are you standing beside? Hey, you. My camera wouldn't focus. No shit? Yeah. I don't know, I just got this really sharp pain in my neck. Did you? Yeah. My head's been hurting like the whole time. But I don't know if maybe it was my necklace. I don't know. It felt very, very odd. Are you frightened? No. No, we're not. We're not frightened. We just really like to talk to you and. If you could know you. If you could show yourself, that'd be amazing. Or make an object move, or. We just want to prove that you're here with us. But we have to see it. 
That was behind me. We like your little taps and all the the noises you're making. Maybe make one of these uh, devices go off, like the yes no pyramid. Uh, I believe the EMF is going. Yep, it's going off. Wait, that EMF oh. just went off. Oh. It would not focus here, and as soon as that went off, it focused. Instantly. I watched it happen. Like, they moved. They must have moved. Guys, I, I don't know if I just witnessed, like, hearing something move, or... Here, let's try this. Let's all go out here for a second real quick. Let's try and make it easy for him. Oh, oh! You were nowhere near that. No, this camera can see me clearly. We're all gonna stand right here, and we're gonna look around, see if it's you can move candles. something. We Where need to see it. Where are candles at? Dude, they're trying to move some things around here. Use all this energy we got. How about this? I'm gonna set my camera over here, keep my mic going so we can catch any noise as possible. The chandelier's moving. Candles. It is. It is. It absolutely is. If you can, please give us a sign. Am I tripping, Wyatt? Uh, no, you're right. It's spinning. What was that? Tripping. Watch, watch the top is, middle is, left, middle is. right corner. If you can, please give us a sign. Am I tripping, Wyatt? Uh, no, you're right. It's spinning. Did you just see that? That one just went. Did you get that, Wyatt? Should have. It's still going. That one is still going. You met? Yeah. That was in the bathroom again. What? What the f was that? What bro? was that? What? Bro. That was straight a, a voice. And then there. Creepy. Yeah, I agree. Kill. Killed. <clears throat> oh. What if those two are in there because one of them killed each other and the next one killed himself? Yeah, I hope I'm no, wrong. It legit sounded like it was right in what the next. He was way closer. Explain. Like a full woman's voice. No, it sounded like like I don't, I can't I couldn't understand. I couldn't understand the words, but it was literally like something like. Yeah, it sounded like a whispered voice. I heard it. If any of you are here with us, I don't know if there's more. Can you come sit either here with us, or you can sit over there, give us a sign that you're there again? How? Uh, I can how? show you. Please don't mind, don't be scared of me. I'm just gonna walk over here. So just like how we were doing, we are sitting there on the couch. Or you can sit right here, or this one. You can show me that you are here. Please give me a sign. Oh. Oh, Ryan, that was creepy. Huh. Some someone is, just sitting in the. Is the EMS going off on the floor? The SLS figure in the doorway, and then sat in the chair and then went away. No, uh. Yeah. No, uh. Perfectly, and then it went completely away. Um. I didn't touch it. I didn't touch it. Well, me. That's the second time. You're far enough. It looks oh. like. Hang on. I didn't touch it. Can you please explain what you needed help with so we can try and help you out? Because we don't His know if you don't like focus, it here, man. or maybe you want somebody to that could be, a sign be there too. for you. But just know, when we are around, you're safe from whoever it might be, if that's the case. And if you would like to leave and be away from here and get off this, surprise. get off this area. Surprise! Device surprise! surprise. There's a orb that went from right to left. No, no way. way. At the same exact time? Right so which... 
Let's try this. Do you want to leave? Do you want to be out of here? Just hold on to this object here. If you're sitting here, use your energy, use mine, manifest everything you have, or don't touch it at all. I'm going to give you five seconds here, then I'm going to ask another one. Okay, do you like it here then? Would you like to stay but need help with something else? Hold this object. I'm going to give you five seconds here. Oh so you God, do like dude. it here. Perfect. I got the chill so bad. Now that, we feels, so whoa, bad. That, that was a strong one. Now we need to find out what you need help with. They said they were in pain. Pain. So how do we help you? Get out of the pain. What do you need? Are you heartbroken? No. no. Chair. Chair. Do you know that you're no longer with us? You're dead. Are you just continuing about it? <laughs> do you know that you're no longer with us? You're dead. <laughs> Dude, this is a, I don't know why I found humor out of that. No. no. Chair. Chair. Do you know that you're no longer with us? You're dead. Are you just <laughs> continuing about your life in this room here? Yes? That just scared the crap out of me. Yeah. So you know that you're dead? Thank you so much so far. I just wanted to say thank yeah. you again. It just said yes twice. That was two yeses. Yes twice. Do you mind us being here? Or is it weird for you that there are people that stay in this room while you're trying to live on? Probably. What did you need help with? We know that you like it here. I hope you're positive that you want us. Close that door that was right there. Really weird. No, was that? I think that was that door creaking. That came up with orange for a second too. Is that you over there? Ball. Close that door. Did any of you guys yeah, hear that I loud did. knock? Yeah. We want to be ball. Ball. See, the thing is, though, is they are in a part. They are in a hotel, so that could be from that loud knock. It kind of sounds like as if someone was like below you, you know. But I'm not gonna question it. Close that door. Did any of you guys yeah, hear that I loud did. knock? Yeah. We want to be friendly with you. More importantly, we'd like to help you. If we can, then we can try our best. There's a figure standing behind me. Is it tracking me too, though? Yes, it is. Dominic. You're right behind me, are you? The figure's above you. That's how the show dominates. Still going? Is it still on uh, mapping? Yes. 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 You just asked if they're right behind you. Oh, what are you man. doing behind Ryan? I'm the dominant one. I'm just going to tell you that. There's no way you're going to be able to control me in any way. I have protection. That is like the wrong thing to say. Oh my gosh. But I will tell you this. If you are okay with me telling you that I can help you, if you are in need of help, then let me know what it is that you need help with. You don't want to leave. I don't know who we are talking to right now. Either Arthur or Sandra or somebody else. So far, what we do know is that you don't want to leave here. So if you don't tell us an answer on how you need help, then we can't give you help. Bathroom. Angel. What? The orb came from this room. Sitting. Sitting. I'm still around. If it's Arthur sitting next to me. Whoa. That was a bang. Arthur? Or Sandra? Whichever one is here, can you please sit and hold on? Both. Okay. Okay.
Thank you. I was just gonna ask if they could please hold on to one of these objects. I didn't see that one go off. I saw that one that and one. this one. So, is there one sitting over at the bar and the other one sitting right next to Ryan? Can you maybe answer yes or no on that pyramid over there? Please, go red right. for no. You're right. I have a question. Is the figure behind Ryan someone else? Is it not either of you? Ooh. That was a freaking Significant. Loud, loud one. So who is that? Was it just you trying to get our attention? Oh, I'm feeling weird, boys. We're friends. We're, We're friends. friends. Yeah. I've had a theory this whole time because I've been watching the responses. The first one said dominant. The next one said angel. The next one said significant. And this one said we're friends. What if it's someone watching over you or protecting you? I just got the worst chills and kind of hit me a little bit emotionally, not I'm, gonna lie. That, I've had this theory the whole time. Have I ever told you this story, guys? This story, you know about it, Nick. You know about it, River. I don't know if I told Wyatt. The time that I got hit by a truck. I was driving a moped, had it for a week. I was driving down one of the main roads, started to take a left. It was about midnight. I was trying to merge left to go onto another road. A drunk driver hit me with her 4x4 Ford lifted truck, and I flew in the air. I blacked out, and I felt, and I saw somebody while I was in midair carry me back down to my feet. I got hit so hard that they said I should have had a broken leg or a broken arm. The only thing that did happen was I have now a scar. It's on the side of my hip. It's actually a little bit lower than my hip. It's right on my leg. Leg. Leg? There was no way that that just said leg. Can you, can you look at that? Does that really say leg? I should have died that night. No. No, you shouldn't have. Whoa. Holy Dude, I just got so much chills right now. Like, that is crazy. Shit, dude. Chill, dude. Me too. I'm not even kidding. Okay. Dude, I think somebody's here for me right now. Silence. I think somebody's here for me right now. this as I was talking how would this energy this whatever this is know all this stuff as I was saying it supposedly they can that's interesting especially like the part that really got me was when you said I should have died the yes no said no as soon as you said leg the leg yeah I said leg that was unexplained that was <clears throat> unexplained that was obviously that was unexplained obviously it's super weird. That was a voice. Right in the Come here. Right You're in the general right area. Okay. Did you get that? Uh, please tell me you got that. You told me to come here, or somebody come here at least, I think. Guys? Go left. Go left, go left. As soon as the- Oh my god, dude. Oh god. Interactive. Oh god. Okay. I'm here. What's that door, a closet? What do you want from him? What? <laughs> Ghost. Oh! Ghost. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh my god. I'm so scared. 
I'm so scared. Is that going all the way off, Ryan? Keep going. Keep oh. going. What do you want? You want me to shut the door? I don't want to. Our device had said go left, so I decided to go left into that one room where we kept hearing all of those noises. Why it was filming me, and as soon as I started to back up inside that room with the EMF meter, it started to go crazy. Having a figure at the bar? No shit. I just heard that. Obvious. Yeah, I don't know why. Oh. That was 100% a scratch, for sure. It sounded just like it. It actually didn't even, it's it, like if I were to put it together, not even a male scratch, like a female scratch, like long nails. Did you just scrape the door? No. You, you didn't? Mm-hmm. Go, 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 go. Wait. Come back. Come back, come back, come back. Come back. What? I swear the safe door moved as soon as you ran out and an you. orb followed. No, no, no. Oh. No. Did you just She said the safe door mm -hmm. moved. Let's keep a lookout. You, you didn't? Mm -hmm. go, 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 go. Wait. Come back. Come back, come back, come back. The safe door moved as soon as you ran out. I didn't know. see An it. An orb followed you out, bro. I told you, I told you, I told you, I told you, I told you. Bro. It's oh, dude, this one's for you, Cass. Oh, dude. The chicken. Rainbow it. There. There. Close that safe. I'm just waiting for that door to just, like, pondering, just slam. No. Okay. Close it. Having an anxiety attack. Hold it. You in here? Green! Green. I just asked, are you in here? Can you close the safe? Please. Do it. But don't scare me. Can I send this here? Can you make this object go off in here? Did you see it? Did you see it? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Yes. <laughs> what the f***? Why? Oh my god. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for showing us that you were here. I just want to let you know that if you need any help, it's me. It's me. Which one? Who is it? What's your full name? First, middle, and last. Oh. Beatrice. Gloria. Gloria Beatrice. Luca. Walk oh, she just gave her a full minute. fucking name. Bro, she just gave her... I thought she gave, like, her last name and her first name. No, she gave her first name, middle name, and last name, just like they asked. Oh, my God, dude. What do you mean, wait a minute? Did you just ask for last name? You did, huh? I said first, middle, last. Beatrice Gloria Walker. Somebody just sat down. Somebody just sat down. I swear. What the f***? That is, that sounds like a full name. Beatrice Gloria Walker. Gloria Walker. Who is that? Where are the other two that we're talking to? Yes, I'm mapping Beatrice. a figure in front of it. Mapping a figure in front of it. It's going crazy. On the SLS. Gone. Yo. Yo.
That is wild, on, man. Thank you so much. Did you just leave? Please walk in front of that again. That was amazing. Do the same thing you just did. Please. That is insane. We literally just got here. That was at insane. This point. And I mapped and it on the can, can can we just hold up a second? I'm sorry for interrupting. For all the people that go in the comments and say that they don't believe in the SLS, we try to believe in the SLS as much as possible because we've had some really compelling evidence with the SLS. Now that, he had mapped somebody there and they were in front of the pyramid and the pyramid is motion detecting object. It's a motion detecting object figure was moving around exactly. too. They disappeared and it stopped. Now please tell me what you guys think about that. That is incredible. Obviously it's not perfect, but you can't discount that. We've had some good evidence with it tonight too, especially the figure behind you. I don't know what's going on. There has to be some type of portal here. Yeah, something. What do you mean some type of portal, dude? Look at the mirror wall. There's so many mirrors. There's no way that there's not, like, not well, a portal So here. it started out... Wait. So it's Try something. Green. It's a green. green. Oh, shit. Oh. oh my god. That green, green. dude. That was a scary, bro. Want to scry? What's that? Ooh. What's a scry? Scrying involves a mirror. Essentially, it's a way to contact someone Is through a mirror. Is it evil? Yeah. No, it's kind of like an ancient practice sort of yeah, thing. Yeah, it's, you do. it's a divination or ritual. <laughs> Supposedly, you sit in front of a mirror and you ask them to show themselves to speak to you. Divination with a mirror or another reflective surface is an ancient practice known as scrying. The term originates from the word descry, which means to catch sight of. You listening to us? We're trying to figure out how we can see you, unless if you could figure out how to get enough energy, how to manifest enough to show yourself. I guess what we do is we have to look through a reflection and I, I guess kind of make ourselves a little vulnerable. Someone's sitting right there. Someone's literally sitting right there That's on that thing. That was. Yeah. That's what it sounds like. Someone is literally sitting right there. You hear me? Are you right there? What's going off? Keep going. Somebody's sitting right there. That's one thing I never, um, I've never understood. Like, if ghosts are, like, or, you know, paranormal, um, figures or whatever you want to call them, if they're able to move with silence and stuff like that, why, when they, like, sit down, do they make noise? Or, like, they make noise here or there? Like, aren't they, like, weightless? Because you see in plenty of videos where they just, Go across the whole room, no, no sound, no sound whatsoever. But he's sitting on a bench, and you can hear it as if he's an actual person sitting on the bench. Dude, I'm not even kidding. Someone's sitting right there, bro. You right here? Getting away? I'm not trying to bother it's you. Me. It's me. Oh my god! You, I told you, dude. You can. It's still going. Like creaking. Can you make that go off if if you are sitting right there? Please? Quiet. Red. Red. Red, it's coming closer. Someone is. Gosh. I don't know about you, but I'm, I just keep getting chilled up, bro. Have you gotten the chills at all? Oh, I, I, I don't think they've gone away yet. No way. <laughs> Look at it. Dude, so bad, bro. Okay, I'm going to try to do this this scribe. I, what, what do I do, oh, boys? Dude, 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 dude. I heard a hey. You're shitting me. I swear to God. Guys, I'm starting to get a little scared. Me too. Maybe take a little break. I'm break. getting like... Terrifying. Terrifying, yeah. dude. Because it's terrifying. I'm, I'm getting break, chills dude. and getting a little bit uncomfortable. I don't know why. True scrying, we may need candles, but they keep saying candles. Yeah. Are you kidding me? Every they guy I've ever read to see them. Every guy I've ever read says candles. They knew exactly that we were gonna say 
to do a scry. And it has to be a dark mirror. Not on the, the is, that's a dark this mirror. This is a not a tinted mirror. Not only does the mirror have to be dark, there has to be no light as well. Dude. Dude, this is a tinted mirror. Literally, look how dark that is. In order to do this, there has to be intention. You could ask for seeing this person or having them show you something. So here's what you want to do, Ryan. You want to close your eyes and focus on your breathing. Make yourself as calm as you possibly can to where you almost feel like you have no more thoughts. You can even ask for guidance from anyone you feel may be protecting you, watching over you. Picture being protected. Okay, I'm gonna go lights out. You ready? Do it. Three, two. All right, Ryan. Now, when you feel completely calm, protected, no other thoughts, think of the intention and what you wanna see and then open your eyes. enough to do this alone. I would not. I probably wouldn't. Why? No, you know, I do this, but I'm already creeped out. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry guys. I, I really wanted to do this, but I don't know if I should. They've showed us enough evidence. Who knows, maybe they are still showing themselves, but I'm not looking. You feeling okay? Mm-hmm. I gotta chill the f out. A little bit. I feel like we tried it. We're not fucking professionals. Oh, f me. F me. No shit. I think I just saw it. I think I just saw it. Where? Hang on. Do this walk again, please. The reverse. Come on out. There's no light. I think I just saw it. Where? I think I just saw something exactly where we've been hearing everything, exactly where everything's been going down. In that room? No, right at that corner, right behind the bar. What? We had decided we were going to try something completely new, and that's scrying with a mirror. Ryan had decided he was going to be the one that would gaze into the mirror and try to see something out of it. I had walked him through all of this, and during the time, the air in that room felt a little off, but it was nothing too shaking. We're not sure if we did this 100% correctly, but we are always interested in trying new things, and we made sure that we were protected beforehand. Now, we have all heard of scrying once before, but coincidentally, all night, our devices kept saying candles. As we did a little bit of research real quick to figure out if we were doing this right, that's one of the necessary tools. We didn't have it, but we decided to go for it anyway. We definitely had to call it not long after that. It did. It did kind of mess everybody up a little bit. I don't really want to provoke anything. The guys don't want to provoke anything. I'd like to leave us on good terms here. So we're going to have to end it here, man. I don't want to continue. If we are going to make them upset by accident, that is not what we are looking for. Definitely been an interesting one. We have caught a lot of activity tonight. Been a good we one. Have definitely proven that there is something here. And the stories do live up, and we want to thank them for everything that they have shown us. And hopefully make them feel comfortable enough for us to be able to sleep here and coexist and hang out. Yes. Yes. Yeah, just said yes. Okay. So that's what we're going to do. I just, if you are right there, can you come over here? I'm going to grab another chair, guys. Sit this right next to me. And Nick, this is open for you. Please, come and sit with us. 
we can finish this night, help you feel comfortable with us. Wait, wait, what was that? That sounded like a chair moving, did it not? It did. That sounded like the bench in the bathroom on hard floor. That's exactly what that sounded like. If it was, we have a camera there. Do you have a camera then? Go look. No. It's coming. Thank you. Hell of a lot in here. You can just tell. They just got closer. Mm -hmm. Reed, did you move something in the bathroom? Is that you? And you come over here, sit in one of these. Chairs. I'm filming this. Thank you. I just want to say thank you for everything you've done. All of you. There is more than one, two people here. Just want to say thank you. I really appreciate everything you've done for us. And I just want you to know that if you are not happy here, you are more than welcome to hold on to one of us. And as soon as we leave this property, this area, this building, you are free to go to the light. You do not have permission to hold on to us and stay attached to us, though. We are not giving you permission for that. Now, if you do want to stay here, we hope the best for you. We hope you are safe. And we hope you are happy. Thank you so much for everything you've done. Okay, Ghost Gang, considering our location that we were supposed to go to tonight did cancel, and this was a last minute gift, I'm very, very happy with this outcome. We'll see you guys next week with another, hopefully, amazing investigation. Peace. This investigation so definitely did go really well for us. Considering this location wasn't exactly planned out, but it really did go swimmingly. <laughs> oh my uh, god. Love you guys. Bye. Alright guys, that was uh, Twin Paranormal's new episode that came out today. Uh, what's today? July 25th. So, make sure you guys give them a, ch uh, uh, a look at and um, I'll leave their video, uh, their channel link down in the description below. You guys let me know how it was. I'll catch you on the next one.